I knew I wanted to fight with him, and I think my management presented it to the UFC. The UFC liked it, but I think he was, Elias was looking for a different fight. So I kind of went on Twitter and, you know, made a challenge him to a bet. Initially, I told him if he won, I put him up in Vegas for a week, wherever he wanted to. And if I won, I shave his head. Um, he did, a lot of the fans were like, oh, Vegas is whack, this and that, which I don't know. I feel like everybody wants to come to Vegas. But uh, yeah, so I changed it. I was like, all right, I'll shave my head, you know, whatever. I, I don't care what it was. I would have done whatever because this is a fight I wanted and this is a fight I'm confident I'm going to win. He didn't agree to shaving his head. You know, he loves his hair too much, but uh, he did agree to the fight. So here we are. I'll shave my beard, my eyebrows and my head if he wanted to, to match the hair. It's a fight that I wanted. It's a fight that I'm very confident. Um, and, and it's against another tough guy. You know, he, he's, he's won the Ultimate Fighter. He's stacked up some wins. I think he's only lost once or twice. I'm not even sure, but uh, I know he's been doing very good. He's a tough guy. He's, uh, he's one of those guys. He's pretty well-rounded. There's, there's nowhere in the fights where you see where he's like, oh, okay, he's definitely, that's where you need to beat him. He, he's pretty tough everywhere. But I think, you know, I'm better than him in every aspect. I think I have the better striking. I think I have the better wrestling. And I think I have the better ground game. I always come fully prepared and in shape and ready to go to war. I'm super confused as to why they're doing an interim fight. Um, Cause I don't know, I guess it was because the whole Bisping GSP fight fell through, whatever. But uh, I mean, it, it's cool that they're doing it. You know, it, it gives, it gives uh, Whitaker or Romero a chance to, to get the belt. And then eventually after that, unify the belt. The fight itself, I love the fight. I think it's an exciting fight. I think it's two guys, two guys who I faced, lost to both of them, but two, two guys who really deserve, you know, to deserve to be there. The past couple of years have been just up, down, up, down, um, as far as wins, losses go. But uh, I definitely want to get back on that winning streak, go back on another run and, and you know, and <clears throat> challenge for that title. I feel like, especially our, any of the guys in the top division, like I, I would love to have a rematch with Romero or Whitaker, you know, um, and I'm sure I'll, I'll get there. So right now, my focus is on Elias, come July 7th, beating him, getting past him, and whoever it is that they want me to fight next, is, you know, I just want to keep going up and up, build that win streak up, and get eventually to that title.